That's the one what took my hand, all right. You get yourself ready, boy. Now we playing with power.
Let's take the fight to her. Scaly Pete remains resolute. Where's she at? I don't know. Ah! Big enough to toss him now, eh? Can! Get that can! Down him! Pete, get one! What remains of the boat lurches, then slowly sinks to the bottom of the sea. The shark returns once again to her safe haven. Hunger is a driving force for the bull shark. Prosperity Sands features glittering white beaches fenced off for the sole enjoyment of the ultra-rich, mega-rich, and super-rich.
This trimaran, like many before it, was lost in its journey to the mythological dry land. Supercharged with gene-altering mutagens, the shark now has an asymmetric edge on the competition. Quiet space is the ideal stage for the shark to meditate and harness her pure potentiality. by Roger Cantrell recently broke the state record for number of revocable commercial fishing offenses. Another shark situation. Humans' attention spans are short. They've already forgotten about the shark and her many crimes, so the sense are not to win.
balanced ecosystem is a complex and multifaceted process, what harm could arise from killing a bunch of seals? Plausible that sharks have learned to depend on the reliable abundance of human swimmers along the Gulf Coast. is now underway. have seen less than 5% of our oceans, which means there's still plenty of treasure out there for everyone. The planet's great tides encircle the globe in constant motion. Thanks to powerful risk assessment software, we now know that this was a wildly idiotic place to build vacation homes. Each year, North American offshore drilling rigs leak about 80,000 gallons of oil into the sea, leaving it for marine wildlife who know nothing about running a profitable Five hundred million years of terrestrial evolution reaches its apex with prosperity sand spacious flow through floor plans. Six hundred twenty nine days, prosperity sands ain't had no shark attacks. You can take old Pete for that. Hey, shark, get your ass out here. No one can tell what may be found in a shark's stomach. It's truly the ocean's garbage can. It seems Port Clovis has forgotten all about its rogue shark, for now.
It was discovered that their Stonehenge replica was astronomically misaligned. Enraged Port Clovians threw it in the ocean. Over the course of a bull shark's life, it will ingest quite a broad assortment of flotsam and jetsam. Sometimes even sharks just need to dirty blood. Protein caches like this one are a convenient and tasty way for sharks to increase their protein intake. The Gulf Stream brings warm waters northeast across the Atlantic towards English seaside towns filled with cranky pensioners, donkey rides, and heroin addicts. Prosperity Sands reminds us that sometimes the construction of second and third homes supersedes considerations like loss of species diversity. Caviar Key features painted sails, a luxury five-star resort built over the remains of Tunamacha, a pre-Columbian city that was once host to the most advanced civilization in ancient America.
theorized that sharks are attracted to come ashore by the refreshing tropical scent of wine coolers. So begins another reckless campaign of extermination. They boated painted sails. But, you know, so do a lot of other New York couillons. Hunt ends. But this is a mere pause in the eternal struggle between man and nature. is often referred to as the king of the ocean, which gives it a skewed understanding of the role of a monarch in modern society. Now a dangerous army of lawless, trigger-happy sadists begin shooting anything that moves.
may find this appalling, but it's just nature doing its work. Once you accept that our modern industrial civilization is just one... Even the self-driving technology of Gazorpazor is not without its reliability concerns. It's another unsuccessful shark hunt for the people of Port Clovis. These scavengers of the sea are vital in cleaning the ocean floors of edible and semi-edible There would have been more protests surrounding Prosperity Sands were not the public already so numb about ecological concerns in general. While fears of ecological apocalypse are valid, you should see Exico Petroleum's previous quarter's earnings. Local resorts have responded to sea level rise by importing 285,000 tons of sand and counter. Flamingo boats have relatively few natural predators with the exception of crocodile pool floats. Most shark hunters have close friends or family members who have been eaten or half eaten by sharks. <laughs> Mutagen 23 is certainly heating up the evolutionary arms race.
Port Clovis has grown bored of the hunt, leaving our shark to fight another day. Peace of the Grotto enables the shark to approach the world with greater confidence and effectiveness. capable of living in climates tropical or temperate, in the water or on land. There is nowhere that man can truly be considered safe from its attacks. Another shark hunt begins. After the end of the tiki craze, bar owners toss their Polynesian-inspired decor into the gulf, where their kitschy charm is completely lost on native marine life. Destruction of natural coastal habitats is sometimes necessary to build vacation homes for private equity fund partners. Upon using this medication, if you experience priapism, do not attempt to improvise your own surgical shot. Another shark hunt draws to a close.
The shark uses lipids from high-fat hair like this to help fuel her reign of terror. water's murkiness, or turbidity, can significantly raise the risk of a shark attack. Poseidon ruled the waters, whereas here at Prosperity Sands, they're ruled by Luxury Leisure Groups International.
Pete, what's in the barrels? Fish food. Pete, whatever this is, can I ask you not to do it? I'm gonna get that shark. One way or another. It's, it's just that this is unnecessarily destructive. I mean, it's just one shark. There's a whole ecosystem. One shark? That killed my boy. Pete, look, I, I understand. Wanna keep tugging on this knot, you? Within three-fourths of geologic time, the land was uninhabited, without a single destination spa anywhere to be seen. The appetite of this shark is nearly insatiable. Noted by lusty appetites, the shark's sole aim is to eat and evolve. Shark discover the miracle of self-love. 